So, um, <clears throat> I just stopped by um, Nancy's barbecue. I can't even tell who I'm getting it because I'm driving. But um, I went to Nancy's barbecue in um, downtown Sarasota. Um, and they have the best barbecue ever. Um, as far as I know, it's not a not a franchise or a chain, so it's a local restaurant, which I prefer going to local restaurants versus like big corporations and stuff, so excuse me. But um, I went on a little late lunch. Um, their barbecue is amazing, and if you're ever in Sarasota, you have to go to this place, because if you like barbecue, then you'll really like this place. They're like the best in town, in my opinion. Um, <clears throat> although there's one guy that has one of those, um, <clears throat> like, street food carts or whatever, um, and he has really good barbecue too, but um, I don't remember the name of his company, and... <clears throat> I haven't seen him around town in a couple of years, so I don't know if he's still doing his thing or what, but um, I'll have to find out and see and let you know, but Nancy's Barbecue in downtown Sarasota, I'll put, I th I'm pretty sure they have a website, I'll put their website down in the description, so um, yeah, I don't know why I'm still rambling, but they're just so good. Um, I know I'm... I'm trying to go back to the vegetarian thing, but I think I'm going to be a mostly <clears throat> vegetarian and then occasionally like have meat and stuff because <clears throat> I like having barbecue every once in a while, so um, I just feel better physically if I'm generally speaking a vegetarian and like not, does that make sense what I'm trying to say? Like not having meat like a majority of the time, maybe just having it like once a month or something like that so yeah so um i'm just i went to go check my p.o box and um i cut through downtown sarasota to um make the drive a little shorter to get home and um i was passing by the golden apple dinner theater which i think opened back in like 1980 i think i could be wrong on the date but um, a few months ago, they were evicted, and the Apple shut down for a couple of months, I think. I forget how long it was, but, um, they were able to reopen, I believe, under new operation, um, under new owners or something, I'm not sure. But I just drove by, and they had for lease, they had a lease sign out in the front of the building, and um, I just looked it up on my phone and unfortunately the Golden Apple is going out of business again, which totally sucks. Um, I don't know the whole story, but um, yeah, apparently the Go I think they're officially going out of business for real this time because this is the second time that they've had to shut down, so. Um, when I get home, I'll be able to finish reading the story, but it just sucks because I went there every year for my birthday for like six or seven years, so yeah, there's that. It just, it just sucks, you know, because A, I love theater and it's just a great place and I love the building and the people there are great, so it just sucks to hear that the theater isn't able to keep their heads above ground, you know? So, yeah. Hey guys. I'm gonna go lay down. And, um, I'm gonna start reading, um, Hostage to the Devil, which I need to read for my demonology class that I'm going to be taking. So, yeah, um, I'm gonna go and I shall talk to y'all tomorrow. Bye.